All right, and now this swoopy line is a, a challenge for some of us. Um, and the swoopy line that Matt, what matters about the swoopy line, swoopy line, is that if we look at it really carefully, every curve, if you zoom in enough, I mean, we can't do it here, but every curve is, is really just a bunch of straight lines added together. So we got some straight lines that are very shallow here. And then as time passes, those straight lines start to go up vertically like this. So they start to move towards vertical like this. So they move from shallow to steep. And we remember from class, or maybe we don't, that a shallow line on a position versus time graph can either correspond to slow or fast, do you remember? So shallow line corresponds to slow or fast, whereas steep line corresponds to, do you remember? Now, we did a couple examples of this in class, and I wonder if any of them are still here. We did. We looked at this one, where we had a, uh, a shallow line versus a steep line. Um, and we were able to calculate that in class. So you can look back at these notes if you're a little lost on that. But uh, for the sake of this video, what we need to know is that in a shallow line, a person does not move as much distance in as long of a time. So if we look at an example of a 100 meter race, let's say we have a student who's wicked fast, they run the 100 meter race, and they're able to do it in maybe a realistic amount of time, 12 or 13 seconds. But then we also have a very slow student, a student who may be on crutches, a student who may just be off, off their game that day, a slow student running or walking in 26 seconds. This is a steep line right here. And this is a shallow line right here. The steep line corresponds to the faster pace. Steep, let's get that correct. The steep line corresponds to faster, and the shallow line corresponds to slower. What that means is that there is uh, the same distance in less time. Cool. Same distance in less time means faster. So I think I'm going to break this video right here. Uh, oh, sorry. No, before we do that. What that means is that in uh, this region right here, where the lines are steep, that means a person is going fast. And in this region, where the lines are shallow, where this, the slope is shallow, this means they're going slow. So starting slow and going fast has a word. We remember that velocity means speed, uh, and acceleration means speeding up or slowing down. So in this final region, this first region, this is the region of acceleration. And if this were a perfectly smooth parabolic curve, it would be constant acceleration. Okay, gonna break this video right here so that we can, so we've gone through all four regions of one, two, three different four kinds of scenarios in a position versus time graph. Uh, next video is going to look at numerical versions of this and the synthesis of these two things, which is going to matter um, on our quiz.